Some farmers don't have enough groundwater available to irrigate their fields, nor have they the option of creating a pond. So they have to rely on town water. That sounds expensive, but if you use the water efficiently, it can be very productive. Here's how it's working for a farmer's collective in Mainz. The fruit growing area in Mainz Finten in the Rhine Valley. Small scale field plan, lots of parcels, lots of owners, all with the same problem. In this area, the average rainfall is only 18 inches per year, and most of that rain falls in autumn and winter. But in the summer, when the fruit needs it most, we definitely do not get enough rain. We get undersized fruit and, without irrigation, can never achieve top quality yields. It became clear that conventional irrigation, using water taps that had to be manually operated in each field, would be way too labor intensive. So in 2013 they opted for an automated process operated by radio control. Today nine farmers are connected to the system covering a total area of 160 acres. The primary services with main lines and manholes are managed collectively, while irrigation flow and timing for each field are controlled by the individual farmer. Each grower can access his own fields on his personal computer, so he can decide for himself when and how much he should irrigate a field and when he wants to seize irrigation when there is enough rain. As the groundwater level in this area is too deep to run private wells, the group purchases its water from the public network. Irreport provided an integrated operating and control system connected by radio transmission to the central computer, which lists all users and their irrigation plans, tracks local and regional weather data and logs all information from the soil sensors in the fields. Here you see the program set up for our apple orchard. Irrigation time is set at three hours. Here we see the water flow of each valve. I can specify which days I want to irrigate. In this case, it is Saturday. Once the day, time and duration are keyed in, it all runs fully automated. Radio-controlled automation can take over almost all operations in the irrigation plant. As with all software, of course, it takes a little practice. By now you have had two years of experience. What do you think? Did it pay off? Would you recommend it? I would definitely do it like this again. Okay, in the first month or during the first year, you might face more challenges than with a manually operated system. But once it's up and running, it makes our job so much easier, especially during the main season, when you really don't have time to spare. You don't have to drive out in the fields to operate it. This is a tremendous asset and far outweighs the initial cost. Irreport. Wireless irrigation.